National Security Contributor H.R. McMaster, a retired Army Lieutenant General, and he's also National Security Advisor under President Trump. General, good morning to you. Uh, we just talked a little bit there with Catherine about how complicated these trade-offs are. Uh, huge day, very significant uh, prisoner swamp, one of the most significant of the Biden administration, arguably one of the most significant America has undertaken going all the way back to the 1960s. I think we should start just with your reaction to it. Hey, good morning, Tony. Well, yeah, I shall share your sentiment and what Gail articulated there about how happy we are uh, that Bernie Griner's back. You know, of course, what we're dealing with is a criminal state, right? We know that Vladimir Putin not only uh, arbitrarily uh, detains uh, innocent people for political leverage, but he also commits murder of individuals and mass murder in what we're seeing in in uh, in Ukraine and, and what we saw in Syria and, and Chechnya from, from this criminal state. But I think what's really important to, to note is that a lot of people have been working on this for a long time. And I think it's uh, it's important to recognize that the Biden administration prioritized, you know, getting Brittany Griner back. Uh, they've also prioritized getting others out like Trevor Reed. And I think uh, this is an important duty for every administration. I remember when Aya um, Hijazi was was released under the Trump administration or Chaplain Brunson from Turkey. Now, those were from ostensible, you know, partner states. Uh, but it's even tougher, you know, to get people out of Russia. And and uh, I'll tell you, Tony, it's it's also important for us to keep in mind those who are left behind. I'm sure that this is what Brittany Griner will, will make this point as well. This is Paul Whelan and 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 uh, Mark Fogel, for example, who remain uh, unlawfully detained in Russia. All right, we're thinking about them also today. As yeah. happy as we are for Brittany Griner, no one is Absolutely. forgetting the two other Americans who yeah. are there. Absolutely. Uh, General McMaster, thank you very much. We appreciate your perspective on all this. But uh, we want to emphasize it is a great day. President Biden expects